Hey everybody, my name is Billy, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. In the last episode, we destroyed the Viridian Forest and burnt it to the ground. In this episode, we are going to tackle Pewter Jim. Hopefully. And hopefully come off for the better. Okay, so what do you have to say? Blah, 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 blah. Uh, he just wants to advise us about becoming the best trainer we possibly can. Well, I think I'm already there anyway without your help, so ha 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 ha. Anyway. Let's just see if we've got Ashley. Yep, Ashley's out front, that's good. Let's go! Yeah, okay. Stop right there, kid. You've got 10,000 light years from facing Brock. Campylion. Hmm. Geodude. Okay, there should be no problem with Ashley. Go. And you bubble, of course. And this should one hit KO it. If not, I'm going to be worried. Okay, I'm worried. Okay, then. That means bubble is sucking, and I'm a little under level for this gym. Oh dear. I should be okay, though, since I've got bubble. So, let's hope. I hope so. I really hope so. Okay, Geodu fainted, and if I'm correct, he has a sand true as well. Yes, I think he does. Okay. Bubble. Okay, what's that? Oh uh, god, I this bubble is weak. Very, very weak, and it's going to do some stand attack. Oh god, I hate stand attack. And uh, never mind, it's hitting anyway. Okay, so. Oh, come on, nearly! Come on, come on. Uh, more defense rings. <laughs> and now uh, it should be dead. Yes, it's dead. Well, okay, the Shantra is dead. We get more experience. And level 13, where well, hey. Sweet. And, oh, water gun, yes, yes. Let's uh, replace bubble. And we have now got water gun, which is a, well, basically better than bubble, obviously. So we should be actually be able to tackle the gym now. <laughs> I'll go back and heal just to make sure we're in top form. Okay. Let's do this thing. Blah 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 blah, I'll take your Pokemon. Yes, okay, we've been through this many times and we're going to go through this many times again. <sighs> oh dear. Okay, let's head back to the gym. Very slowly. <sighs> okay, come on, chop chop chop. Run, run, run. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, my rock hard will power my Pokemon are all rock hard though. Okay, that is dirty. <laughs> that is quite dirty for a Pokemon game. That is worrying. Very, very worrying. I do not like the sound of that. Do this thing. Okay, first off, he has a level 12 Geodude with the attacks. Um, tackle and defense curl. Okay, well that went down very, very fast indeed. Now, he also has a level 14 onyx with the moves, if I'm correct, tackle, bind, rock throw and bide. Which is yeah, not too bad of a strategy I suppose, but... Oh, sorry, no, I'm wrong. It is Tackle, Bind, Harden, and Rock 2. My mistake. I'm trying to go off memory here with something right in front of my face, which obviously didn't go too well. And this is the f one and only gym after that you receive the gym badge in the actual gym battle screen. Every other you get it after, which is also very nice. 
Okay. TM39, which is Rock Tomb. It lowers the speed of a Pokemon that it comes. Yes, it hurts a Pokemon with it's got a pretty crappy uh, attack um, accuracy and it lowers just the speed if it hits and yeah, none of my Pokemon can learn it, so on we go. I just I thought you were yeah, I'm champ material, I know. Right. I hope correct we head right after this town to Mount Moon. Yay. Very slowly still. And hopefully once we've healed up and start to leave town, we might get a very, very special item. Yes, that will help me speed things along much faster. If you know what I'm talking about, then good for you. <laughs> okay, again, healed. And off we go. To the right, to the right, to the left. Take it back now, yo. No, I'm sorry, that was bad. <laughs> okay, Professor Oak's aid, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Okay, we have running shoes. We can run now. We can move fast. I'm happy with this. Well, hey, I'm very happy now. So, and uh, oh, letter attached. Dear Billy, here's a pair of running shoes from my beloved challenger, for Mum. Oh, goody. we can run! Yay! Okay, now onto this route. Is the item down here? Let's just check. No, there is not. I'm kind of contemplating whether to skip some of these battles. Um, I will decide that as we go along. For now, we will just <coughs> excuse me. We will just carry on as normal. Okay, so what do we have? Dead last, Janice, <laughs> who has a level nine Pidgey, should be no problem for Sammy here. Okay, Thunder shock. Okay, and bada bing, bada. Oh come on. Sand attack, of course, yes. Sand, sand attack spamming, that's the worst thing ever. Okay, now that Pidgey is deaded. On to the next, what do we have? 105 experience for Sammy, and another Pidgey. Easy. Easy peasy. Get the Thundershock again. Okay, and... Woo, critical! Critical hit. Super effective, and... Sammy is nearly level 11, well hey. I mean, yes, thank you for that. You wanted a battle, I battled. Okay, uh, that's obviously a bug catch up above, so I'm switching to Carla. Okay, let's do this thing. Okay, uh, you met me in Vir 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 Viridian Forest, did we? I cannot remember. Colton? I cannot remember Colton. Anyway, go Colton, Carla. Colton. Colton. Okay, tackle. Well, why did I do tackle? I was meant to do gust. Stupid trigger finger. Anyway, gust. Gust that day. Super effective and deaded. Yes. Weedle. Okay. Uh, stay with Carla. Yeah. Get your Colton out. Weedle. Level 10. Weedle. Gust. Yay. Dead. Okay. Next pet. I'm sweeping this lot, I'm just going to be leaving a puddle of blood behind me. Carla grew to level 13 as well, and learn quick attack, sweet! Okay, another Caterpie. This wasn't easy enough. Okay, and Gust again, Annihilation. <laughs> okay, super effective, easy. Caterpie, uh, 112 experience, and we're already getting there to level 14, sweet. Okay, next one, let's switch back to Sammy. And let's go. Oh, wait, that's the one. Okay. I like your shorts. Yes, the infamous short guy there. <sighs> yeah. I hate wearing shorts, they are just horrible, horrible, horrible things. Anyway, he sends out a level 11 rat attack. Okay. Quick attack and ha 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 paralyzed shame thundershock this is going to be an easy match thundershock again okay 
Tail whip. Yep, I have finished this. Oh, man, quick attack. I shouldn't do too much. Oh my god, what the hell? What? What? How did that do so much damage? Oh, you are dead for it now, you piece of rubbish shit. Ah, die. That's better. And actually gets all that experience. It's nearly level 15. And he sends out an Ekans. Yep, keep it out. Screw it. I'm not messing around now. You will die. I will annihilate you and your Pokemon and intimidate cuts my attack in half. How lovely. <sighs> yes, I'm not impressed. Leah as well would break loads my defense. Uh, I hate you so much. So, so much. Poison Sting. You better not. Oh, God, I hate this guy so much. So he's made my Sammy faint and uh, now Ashley is poisoned. He is going to regret that. And well at least we go to level 15 so we're hey. But oh my god I will hurt you. <sighs> Great now I have to go all the way back to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, yeah and look as you can see Ashley's HP is whittling down because of the poison. Lovely. <sighs> We're going to be seeing quite a bit of this. Okay. Look once enter blah 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 blah. At least things are going much faster with the running shoes, so hopefully we can get through quite a few places a lot faster. Shame you can't run inside like you can do with the normal the newer games. Now run! 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 Run Forest, run! Okay, Tuggle, you're dead. And another bug catcher. Yeah, screw it, just stay with Sammy. Okay, book catcher Greg. Hmm. Okay, and another weedle. Don't you dare poison me. I will murder you in your sleep if you do. Thundershock. Okay. And half dead. Okay, but don't you dare. Oh my god. And another Thundershock, and you are deaded. Hopefully, yes, you are deaded. Okay, and level 11, where well, hey, Sammy's now level 11, and ooh, trying to learn quick attacks, sweet! So yes, let's get rid of Growl, yes. Okay, one, two, three, and boom! Sammy's got Growl, and learn quick attack, lovely, lovely jambly. And that is a Caterpie. A level 9 Caterpie, weak as hell. So, Sammy is now on a rampage, because he by a backing ratata. <sighs> I'm not impressed with that still. Anyway, paralyzed as well, ha, huh? Thundershock dead. <sighs> 102 experience. Kakuna. Easy experience now. Just a couple of Thundershocks and that will die. <sighs> yes, I'm not even saying the fainting, they are dead. They these things are dead to me. Useless trainer Pokemon things. Another Thundershock, and that should kill it off. And oh, come on! Ugh. Die! It turns up a very gloomy and apocalyptic episode of Pokemon Fire Red, isn't it? Yes, they're all dying. I'm annihilating. I burned the for forest to the ground. I wonder what's next for Mount Moon and this Metapod. Yes. Okay, don't harden yourself too much, you might show something. Giggity. <laughs> that was terrible, I'm sorry for that one. <laughs> oh, come on! <sighs> See, that's the jerkish thing about it. Metapods and cocoons and the harder thing is just pain in the ass. Okay. <sighs> Moving on, and Sammy grew to level 12, yay! No, nothing else learned. Okay, defeat a bug catcher. You know what, this is taking quite a while because we are already 14 minutes into this. So what I'm going to do is cut away and... Well, yes, I'm just going to cut away right, really and... Yes, okay. I'm back. I've defeated all the trainers. And the only thing that's changed so far is Sammy has grown to level 13. Okay, so on we go to 
Mountain Dew. Okay. Did I touch you? You wish. And she's sending out a level 14 Jigglypuff. That is slightly overpowered for this route. The strongest one on the route. And Thundershock, it should take it out quite easily. And oh my god, I'm in trouble. But ha ha ha, paralyzed. What do you do with pound? And okay, I'm not liking that, so go away. Carla, checking you out. Okay. Ha, <laughs> disabled, failed. Uh, you fail. Gust should do some form of damage a bit more. Yes, it does more than that, so. Oh god, not defense kill. You only want a hot Kakuna or Metapod. Stop trying to derage your defense, you stupid puff. Jiggly thing. <laughs> Just don't miss. You will die. Ah, see, told you. I'm a mind reader. I'm good. Okay, and Carl is near level 14. Sweet. Okay, off we go to Mount Moon. Mm -hmm. And something I know about this NPC here is the tunnel from Cerulean takes a lot out of you. How did you get back from Cerulean City? How? It is impossible. It's physically impossible unless that guy is an action replay, you hacker. Because uh, you can't physically get back up there. So how did he manage it? I don't understand how. He must be a complete badass. And heal up once more. Right. something else for this place. Here, this trainer, he will try to sell you a magic op, I think is level 10 for 500 poker dollars, where you could just, well, the next town across, or one of the next towns across, you can just get a, get one magic card with an old rod. So, that will do it for this episode. In the next episode, we will be tackling Mount Moon. So, thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Hey everybody, hey, it's me again, and I would like to apologise for the little mishap at the bottom of the screen. I did not notice it until the audio, uh, sorry, editing. Um, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. It sh I from now on I'm going to make a different save file as well, just to make sure in case I need to re-record. Basically, it was a mishap with either the editing software, sorry, recording software, or with the actual emulator itself, I'm not entirely sure, but I will sort it out and it won't happen again. So, thank you and be patient with me. I know each episode I've been getting a little more mistakey. If that's the right word, that's not the right word, but anyway, again, sorry and I will try to get better. Thank you.